Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl TJ. As you guys can see, we are here with Reshine Hair. And y'all know what time it is. It is vacation time. So if you're looking for a wig, don't look no further. This is, this is the one for you. Look at this hairline. Do y'all not see? They came in the clutch. It's already plucked. That's what I'm here for. So anyway, I do have the wear and go 28 inch water wave wig. All details will be in the description section in regards to the density and things of that nature. So, we're going to go ahead and put it on for the first time. And as you guys can see, the lace is not going to be blended, okay? It mounts, but it ain't blended. So, we definitely going to have to add some tins, right? But look at those curls, y'all. Okay, so now we're just gonna go in with some lace tint spray. I'm telling you, you need this. If you do not tint your lace with concealer, foundation, whatever you got, baby, everybody know, they are gonna know it's a wig. And especially if you're going to go into a swimming pool, baby, you don't need nobody staring at your head, okay? So go ahead and get that all tinted up and I'm gonna allow it to dry. And look at this, y'all, okay? You definitely can tell it's a big difference between tinting your lace and not tinting your lace, okay? So I'm just gonna clean off the um, some of the tint and spray that I actually got on the hair strands because we don't need that. <sighs> Y'all don't play with me with this hairline. Reshine did this hairline. It does come with this middle part. I'm just gonna go ahead and take my dusty comb, which I need to clean. And we're just gonna go ahead and straighten up that part, y'all. I'm just obsessed with this lace. Do y'all not see what I'm seeing? I ain't do nothing, okay? And it's still glueless, okay? Glueless. So I had this bright idea to dry detangle my curly hair. Y'all know I do not recommend that. <laughs> I always say wet your hair before you detangle it because you can create knots and tangles and all that stuff. But this hair didn't do that, y'all. This brush just glided through that hair. Like, what? Now I did get a little bit of shedding, which is normal, which is expected. It's first time detangling hair. It is curly hair. Nothing to worry about. But look at the density. I love curly hair because you can really control the density. But if you go into the pool, wear it like this because when you get in the water, it's going to define anyway. It's no point of defining your hair and getting in water. So we're going to do a hair check. I just want to see if this wig going to stay on if I'm just doing too much. It ain't going to wear, y'all. So normally I don't um, adhere my glueless wigs with any type of spray, but I wanted to today because I just wanted to see what that lace give. I love the lace. It was super thin. And I'm, I'm like, okay, if it melts and it's not even melted, like, you know, with spray, let me just try some lace spray and see what it would give. So that's the only reason why I did this. You do not have to do this step, y'all. I just wanted to do it. Okay. So I'm just taking my blow dryer. I'm waiting until it is tacky. I just aligned the lace to the product, which is now tacky. And then I'm just going to take my comb and just blend that right on in. One thing that I loved about the lace was I didn't have to go in and trim off any extra lace that wasn't needed. So that was an A plus in my book. So we're just going to let our band sit on for about three minutes. So we're going to take it off and see what melted she gave. And baby, when I say she was giving, now it was some extra lace over there that I could have just cut off, but I just ended up doing baby hairs anyway. So we're just going to leave it alone. But look how good the lace looks, okay? Um, I'm parting, and it just looks like straight scalp. Like, you cannot tell me nothing. Look at that. <laughs> Y'all see that natural shine that it had to? Like, it's giving scalp. Don't play with me. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just going to take two sections and cut at an angle so I can create some baby hairs like I said baby hairs are optional you do not need it with this unit either but I just wanted a little pizzazz this day I'm gonna spray some of my even spray on this hairbrush and we're just gonna swoop these baby hairs I don't feel like taking out my one inch flat iron to swoop them I'm just gonna use my finger and the spray and I forgot how good this spray was so I said I'm about to use these for my baby hairs because it was super easy Now I'm just going in to define my part with my cream foundation. Um, I'm back in my regular shade. I just used the darker side 
and look at this part crispy and if I make the part too wide I'm just taking a mica wipe why I always say that like that <laughs> a mica wipe and just wiping off the excess and look how thick this is y'all I'm obsessed okay and like I said if you're going to the pool I don't feel like it's really necessary for you to find to define the curls I would just wear it like this and once you get in the pool you're gonna come out it's gonna be defined anyway but I'm just taking some of my foam wrap lotion, y'all. This is the best foam wrap lotion, hands down. I don't care what your mama say. But I'm just going to take a little bit of this and give a little bit more definition to the curls. Like I, like I said, with curly hair, you're able to control the density. So if you don't want it too thick, you can just go in with some water or some foam wrap lotion and just tame it down a little bit. And that's pretty much what I'm going to do here. Because I, I want it thick, but then I don't want it too thick. So, you know, you see, I'm not going in section by section. I'm just like putting it throughout the hair overall. Lastly, I'm just gonna take my blow dryer on a quickening and setting and just allow that foam wrap lotion to dry. And this is how it turns out. I did the other side off camera because y'all know it's repetitive, it's the same steps. But look how thick and full this is. And like I said, it's not too defined, it's not too, it's just perfect. I love, love, love this. <laughs> like, y'all, it's giving what it's supposed to give. Since it is a water wave wig, I did want to go ahead and wet it just to see what the curl pattern would be like. And this is how it will look all wet. And then I just allowed it to dry a little bit. And this is how it turned out. So this is all to it. Like I said, I didn't do any washing, conditioning, no bleaching, no none of that, y'all. This is just straight out of the box install. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I get this wig a hundred out of ten. Okay. I just I'm obsessed. Okay, all information in regards to this unit will be listed down in the description section below. And until my next video, your girl will see you later. Bye guys. <laughs>